see. All right, we're live. Hey guys, I'm gonna give y'all a minute to get on here. In the meantime, I want y'all to guess where we are. <laughs> if you know me and you followed me a little bit on Facebook, I think you're gonna guess pretty good. This is John putting his drink up. Yeah, yeah, you probably guessed it if you're whenever you because this other people will see this yes. later. Uh huh. Yeah. We got so, somebody over there. Yay! So, um, <laughs> Crystal. Hey, Crystal. Crystal is my niece. And my mom's on here. Thank. Hey, oh, mom. Oh, that's your mom. Okay. Yeah. Hi, mom. Hey. I've met you. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm gonna wait just a minute and give just a couple more people time. I know a couple of people that's getting on here, so I want to make sure that um, everybody gets on here. I'm gonna pick at my hair for a minute, y'all. <laughs> okay. Um, but anyway, um, I want to thank you guys for getting on here, and um, we're going to talk about essential oils in just a minute, and you were added to this group because you're interested um, to learn more, and um, this here is my friend Stephanie Evans, hey. and she is um, going to be training me to help me learn how to teach about essential oils. Hey, Peyton. Hey, Peyton. Um, so anyway, um, trying to remember what else I was supposed to say. So I'm that's, going blank. I'm drawing that's a blank. Good. So um, anyway, Peyton, you probably know where I am, right? Right? <laughs> okay, in case you're just getting on here and seeing. Um, I'm at my favorite place. But you're this welcome. Time I'm, yes, <laughs> you yes. Got, you got your package. Good. Oh, good, good. I got, thank your, you. I got your message last night. I just, it was a 12-hour day, and I didn't have a chance to respond. Yeah. <laughs> So if you want to, um, we can go ahead and start, yeah. and that way, you know, people that come on won't have to wait mm -hmm. too long to. That sounds good. See. Okay, so like Julie said, I am a um, premier wellness advocate with DoTerra Essential Oils, and my job is to teach classes. That's what I do. I love doing it, and Julie is learning how to teach classes, and so we're going to kind of do this together. She's going to add some, maybe some input about how oils work for her or something as we go through here. Um, but first I wanted to ask you, how do you know Julie? So if you will comment below. Some of you may know her from <laughs> your church or maybe you're a relative or maybe um, you know her because you've been seen her, her and her family sing or something. So if you'll just comment below how you know Julie, okay? So I'm just interested. want to know how, how you guys know her. Um, I'm really glad that you're taking time to watch this video. Um, but if you we're not able to get on and watch it at the time it's okay because um, it's recorded and you can watch it later so that's what's great about live videos you're not going to miss the class so as we before we get ready to start I just want to say that when I teach a class we have a, a piece of paper it's called a class tear pad and it's very easy and I just teach right off of this and that's what I'm going to be doing for this um, online class here it's the same information that you would get out of an actual live class and um, but you won't get to smell the oils because we don't have smell a vision <laughs> and you won't get to experience them but you can um, at least get the, the education part so that's what that's what we're gonna we're gonna um, yeah, teach off of oh, hi. Hey, Barbara. <laughs> so if you have ever heard of essential oils if you'll just drop a one at the bottom and I don't we yeah we're seeing some comments so yeah if you'll drop a one at the bottom if you have heard of essential oils doesn't mean that you've ever used them. I'm just curious to see who's heard of them. So if you will do that, okay. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and start talking, okay? We're gonna talk about um, two, four, six, about six different, maybe six to eight different oils right now we're gonna talk about. And first of all, I'm gonna talk about what are essential oils because some of you may not even know what they are, okay? I didn't when I first heard of oils. I didn't know what they were. Um, so essential oils, it's the nature defense mechanism of the plant. Okay, it's the actual plant's immune system. And the immunity that it gives the plant, it actually does the same for our body. So I get amazed at God when I, when I hear the science behind how oils work because I know that only a creator could do that. Um, so they are, the, so again, they're the immune system of the plant and they are natural aromatic compounds that's actually found in seeds, barks, stems, roots, flowers, and other parts of the plant. Like when you have an orange and you've, um, you know when you're cutting an orange, Julie, mm -hmm. and you 
or if you're getting the zest from yeah. it and you get the kind of oil when yeah. you're doing the zest, that's mm -hmm. the essential oil. So that's what that's how you get it from a lemon and from an orange. So that's pretty neat. And um, so it just comes as different parts and different plants. You can extract the oils from um, different areas. So one plant you might get two or three oils from if you get it from your the stems or the leaves or something like that. So that's, that's pretty cool. Um, so the oil I'm going to talk about this is with is the peppermint oil. Um, peppermint promotes a healthy respiratory function. It promotes digestive health, and you can diffuse it when you're feeling fatigued or low on energy. Um, it it really helps with alertness. So if you need to to focus on something, it's really good for that. And um, I wish that you could smell the peppermint. Mm -hmm. um, you can't smell it, but we can. Yeah, we're gonna smell it for you. Mm -hmm. Awesome. <laughs> And um, I have put this in um, brownies. I've put it in. Do you ever make um, cr uh, peppermint bark at Christmas time? I've never made it. Oh, that's amazing. It. Yeah, Christmas. We put it, we did it this year, put it in peppermint bark. Um, maybe the therapeutic properties over the came all the sugar that was in it. Wow. But anyway, peppermint is, is really great um, for lots of re respiratory things. Oh, something that you can do with it is, is that. If you have, if you have like, um, maybe you're feeling stuffed up in here and tight in here, you can um, put a drop on your thumb and stick it on the roof of your mouth and look like a child sucking your thumb. But if you hold it for 10 seconds and then breathe in and it loosens all of this stuff. Mm -hmm. So, um, very, um, very inexpensive way to clear up things oh, going yeah. on in your head. Like for eight cents, you can clear all this up. So that's, that's pretty good. Um, Second is, I want to talk about why essential oils are effective. Okay, so why do they actually work? So, if you remember in school, the outer cell of your membrane, all of our cells' membranes, is oily, okay? So, water can't pass through that. Only an oil can pass through an oil. So, the oils work on a cellular level and they protect the cells and they have a unique chemical structure that allows them to pass directly through the skin for immediate systemic response and when you put it on topical and it can actually pass through a cell so if you have a sick cell you can get it better with using oils that's going to aid the body and give the body what it needs for the immune system so um, things that may be um, I want to say the word viral, but I'm not allowed to, so yeah. I won't say it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sometimes if things are like that, then it works really good for it. So, um, I wish that uh, you could see my pictures. The pictures are really pretty. I want to see if I can get it close. Okay, y'all see the white drop right there? Okay, so that white drop is um, an oil droplet on a peppermint leaf that's been magnified. So, I thought that was pretty awesome. cool. I wanted to show that. So, I want to talk here about um, melaleuca. So, the melaleuca is also known as tea tree oil. So, some of you have maybe have heard of it as tea tree oil. Um, it's the same thing. I'll smell it too. I'm sorry, guys. Mm -hmm. I know what this smells like, but I still have to smell it. I love to put this in my hair when I get out of the pool or when I just wash my hair. I love to put it in there. It, um, it um, nourishes the scalp. It can help with um, those nasty bugs that kids may bring home from school yeah. even the super ones that are hard to get rid of and the melaleuca works really good for that and um, it is good for cleansing and clean with it. it it helps protect against environmental or seasonal threats and then it's um, also it helps with the skin if you have any kind of skin abrasions or things like that it really yes it really helps to promote healing in it yeah right it helps to promote healing and it, and you could use it just even like every two to three hours and you will notice how quickly that it is actually healed so it's it works pretty good my daughter actually got hurt yesterday at camp and um, she sent me a picture of her knee it was all scraped up but it was inflamed mm -hmm. um, just I don't know I still don't know exactly what happened uh, I'd sent certain oils with them trying to think okay what did I send so I had her take an immunity blend that had melaleuca in it it had um, oregano it had 
clove. It had these oils in it that um, are high in antioxidants and oils that really promote healing and reduce inflammation. So I said, roll it all over there and then do it again at bedtime, but we'll come get you in the morning because she couldn't walk. So she calls me today and um, I'm like, why are you out of breath? Oh, I'm running up the hill because I'm late for the game. And I thought, well, I thought I needed to come get you. Oh, no, my, my knee's much better. I, uh, she was running yesterday. She couldn't walk. So I'm assuming that meant the inflammation was yeah. down. And um, I said, are you putting your oils on it? Yes, I am. She said, it's scabbed over. I'm good. <laughs> so it was kind of open yesterday. So um, as a mom, I'm thankful. I felt like I did something to help my kids. Mm -hmm. My kids are away. They're at camp. And I was able to to do to do something to help with that and Peyton I see that your question about psoriasis I can send you more information about that so I didn't want you to think that we didn't see your question and um, so Melica is great for skin abrasions and things like that um, and please ask questions anybody have any questions mm -hmm. ask questions and what we'll do is at the end we'll just um, if it's something that we can quickly respond We'll respond under we'll reply to your question but if it's something that needs more in-depth detail then we'll send a private message for that but please ask away okay all right so next is um we're gonna talk about how to use essential oils because now you've heard some pretty good things about oils right and you want to know how to use them well there's three different ways and um, the first way is aromatically and when we use aromatically we're going to put in a diffuser or we're going to put in our on our skin or our shirt and we're going to just breathing it in is aromatic, okay? One thing that's really exciting to me about when we breathe it in, um, Julie, is mm -hmm. that when we breathe in an oil, any oil, mm -hmm. it um, crosses the blood-brain barrier. And there's not a lot that can anyone can get to cross the blood-brain barrier on things. So breathing in any oil, it does that. A lot of people may not realize that when you breathe something in, it's a straight synapses to your, the nerve is straight to your brain. When you breathe it in, it's already to your brain. Like there's no delay. Like when we touch something hot, there's a delay so that we, our body knows to jerk back. Mm -hmm. When we breathe something, it goes straight to our brains. So yeah, that's pretty, I that's love science. Did you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love science and I love, um, the chair is a science company and I love to know that it's just pretty awesome to realize how these things work. So aromatically, we're inhaling or diffusing because what you breathe actually affects your mood. So um, if you've smelled something that's made you feel bad, then definitely you can smell something to make you feel good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so let me ask you this. If you could use, if you could diffuse oils to help alleviate stress, like if you're like, okay, if there's an oil that can make me feel less stressed, drop a number two on there, okay? And if I had, could type, I would put another two on there too. <laughs> Because immediately, right, immediately. Today. Yeah. <laughs> I feel stressed. My husband's mm -hmm. like, where's your oils, oil lady? Go put your oils mm -hmm. on. Or put something into the diffuser. My kids are, um, I don't know, kind of ornery. We homeschool. So if I don't even tell them. So John, don't tell them I do this. But I will put oils in my diffuser that are commutative oils that kind of help people get along <laughs> and I'll put that if they're going to be in the room if we're all in the room together mm -hmm. I will do that so that's that's just a, a trick with Obamacare right oh yeah Obamacare <laughs> I'm gonna trademark that you need to mm -hmm. okay so also when we diffuse because at first I thought why do I need a diffuser I don't really care what my house smells like <laughs> it stinks I don't care I didn't realize that when you diffuse it does actually affect your mood but not only that it can help you get better I had a child that got sick and her she waited three days to tell me she was sick normally I can knock them out of really quick and her throat was so swelled she couldn't swallow anything so I treated her from the bottom of her feet putting oils on the bottom of her feet and by diffusing a diffused round clock and it it helps to get your body better it really works hey Tyra <laughs> yeah hey. hi my eyeballs <laughs> so also it's gonna clean the air cleans the air so if your kids are if you know that there's they're around other sick kids or there's a virus or something going around just diffuse there's certain oils we have a protective blend we'll talk about in a minute on guard just diffuse it in your house and it helps to clean your house if you're going to a hotel you can clean you can diffuse when I stay at a hotel I, I travel and teach classes and um, all on the eastern 
coast, anywhere that, well, I fly to, but I travel to teach classes, and I, when I stay in a hotel, I diffuse on guard because I don't know what germs are in there. <laughs> there. And also diffuse and also um, supports healthy breathing. Like if when my kids are having issues, maybe they caught something mm -hmm. or something, the, um, which is rare. It's been yeah. very rare since we started using oils. But um, it helps them helps them breathe better. So I'm gonna talk about. You wanna talk, say anything about that? Um. Well, like if you diffuse melaleuca, mm -hmm. it helps um, get rid of mold, right? Is that mm -hmm. helps to. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Melaleuca yeah. is an antimicrobial, mm -hmm. which means it can it helps get rid of mold. We have yes. to we have to think about that in R V because we constantly have you know moisture. Yeah. 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 So. yeah so you should. Especially if you guys aren't in there, mm -hmm. turn the diffuser on. Yeah, yeah, but but definitely, mm -hmm. I would diffuse around the clock. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, okay, so we're gonna talk about. Um, we have an oil blend that's a respiratory blend, and it's called Breathe Oil. And Julie, look at that. It promotes feelings of easy breathing. You can diffuse it at night for healthy and restful breathing, and you can apply two to three drops on your. I'm gonna smell too. I know what it all smells like, but. I have, an, I have a, not an addiction. <laughs> They're not addicting, but I still have them. Um, so this just opens everything up. It, you can put it on the bottom of your feet when your kids go to bed at night. Um, you can uh, put on the chest, but you can also make a little diffuser. And um, you would just put, let me show you. You would put one drop of, well, two came out. One drop of oil, which... I don't know, it might be like seven cents. <laughs> and you're just gonna kind of do like that. You don't want to rub it in good. Um, <clears throat> just want it on. See, hands are shiny. You're gonna make a funnel like that, a kind of open funnel. And so if you have restriction in here, hey Audrey, <laughs> if you have restriction in here, you're gonna, I'm gonna do this and it's gonna make me cough because I had dairy. I, I can't eat dairy, but I had it anyway because sometimes I do that. Uh, <laughs> and, um, it clears in the airway. So if I cough, that just means there's something there that it's trying to get out of the way. But I just kind of want to show you how it works. And we already can smell it, right? Mm -hmm, yes. Yeah. And the, the, you know what? Dunkin' Donuts is going to smell like essential oils. Yes. Before we leave there. But this is what you do. You're going to let out your air. And you're going to inhale, hold your breath, swallow, and let go. Okay? And I may cough like I'm dying. Okay. All right. Okay, couldn't hold my breath. Let me try it this time. I usually have to do it three times. Okay, I did it that time. <laughs> okay, so what I'm experiencing now is that from here to here, everything is open. I just feel mm -hmm. it open up. And Peyton, you tried mm -hmm. this, right? Yeah. yeah. I, can, I feel myself open and just smelling, smelling it. it. So, mm -hmm. yeah. And that was two drops. Mm -hmm. And so, and I only, I didn't even need to do but one. But usually you might want to do, the, repeat it two to three times if needed. But <clears throat> usually it opens it up the first time. Just really depends. Mine's allergies because it, dairy causes inflammation mm -hmm. and it, you know, it bothers me. And yeah, my but, mom asked about allergies. So we'll answer yes. that. Oh, yeah. We'll answer yeah, that definitely. at the end. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that is the breathe oil. Opens everything up. You can diffuse it for your kids if they're having issues. And, and if you have issues where you need to use something that helps open you up through the day or something, you could do this every morning and every night and, and before you need it, and you may not actually need something like that. Okay, so we talked about aromatically. So now we're going to talk about how to use topically, okay? So it's powerful. One drop of essential oil can service every cell of your body. Okay, so I'm gonna repeat that and make sure you understood that. One drop of oil, so that one drop, will chew that bell out, will within two hours, 20 minutes to two hours, will be in every cell of my body, okay? And so only good things can come from that, <laughs> you know? Mm -hmm. It's like if, it's, if I have something that's gonna help me, only good things can come from that. So, um, that's, that's pretty awesome. But you can put it on the um, bottom of your feet or um, on your skin. You can put it on your pressure points, which are here. Um, and then you can put it on your carotid artery. If you're having ear issues, you can put it on the outside of the ear and back behind it and just massage it and pull down. So you're pulling away from your lymph nodes when you're doing things like that. 
Like I can tell my lip notes are swollen. Y'all, I've got to stay away from dairy. <laughs> it's my husband's fault, really. That's I, I wouldn't <laughs> eat it, but he, you know, how do you say no? <laughs> so anyway, so so when you put it on, you're going to put it on um, areas that needed but you can actually put on your spine too but within 20 seconds of the bottom of, or 26 seconds from the bottom of your feet it is um it's in your bloodstream okay so so this is already in like I can breathe so much better now this is has been in my bloodstream since 26 seconds after I dropped it on my on my hand so it's, it's pretty amazing let me see if there's anything else I want to say about oh sensitivity so if you have a child or someone that has sensitive skin or an elderly person or somebody with um, a chronic illness, you're gonna want it to dilute your oils. And you can dilute with fractionated coconut oil. There we go. So you know what coconut oil is, right? You buy coconut mm -hmm. oil at the restaurant. Yeah. Okay, this is different. This is got this is a medium chain triglyceride. It has had the triglycerides removed mm -hmm. so that the oil can pass through all three layers of the skin. It's always solid. You can't hear that but this is I mean it's always liquid this is yeah the liquid. other one kind of hardens up yeah the yeah. other one freezes at like a very 70 something, something degree mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. but this mm -hmm. always stays liquid okay so th this because the triglyceride is actually what makes it freeze and become solid so this is always um, liquid and it can pass through the three layers of your skin so it's known as a carrier oil so if you wanted to put an oil on where you were sensitive you would put like a drop there and then you would put a drop on top. Let me see what oil I'm going to put on top. We'll just do male Luca because it'll make my skin nice. I'll put one drop of male Luca. And then I'm just going to rub it in. Okay. And see, that was a lot. See all that? So the, all that, mm -hmm. just one drop of each, like, did my whole arm there. Okay. Now, what that's going to smell good. <laughs> I'm sorry. If y'all are here, you would understand. Okay. So, um, what that's going to do is it does not dilute the oil where I'm only getting okay well I paid this for this and so now I'm going to dilute it and not get all of it what it does is it allows for slower absorption so it gets in the bloodstream slower mm -hmm. so that if you have any skin sensitivity because this does detox your body it gets rid of the bad stuff and it helps in good ways but it does detox mm -hmm. so you would you would use the um, fractionated coconut oil <clears throat> for that now they have something to stop my nose up. They burnt something or something. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So let's talk now about what are we talk about now. Um, Is that what we're going to? Oh, I forgot to talk about deep blue. Oh. Okay. Let me tell you about deep blue. Um, this oil comes in a couple different ways. It's called the soothing blend. And this, my kids. So it kind of smells mentholate in me. Yeah. 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 So you can get it in this bottle here, like this, which is a five milliliter. You can get it in a roller bottle. So that. See the which roller is bottle? Diluted, yeah. Right? It's already diluted with the fractionated coconut oil. I forget where the camera is. Where's that? Where's. Y'all, I've been looking over here yeah, the whole it's time. Over here. Okay. Hey, can y'all see me now? <laughs> <laughs> um, so it's already diluted. And um, it's good because you can like roll it on your spine or roll it in pained areas. My favorite way that I will not run out of is it this way. This is my favorite. It has a blue. Can you see the blue? See the blue color? Okay, that's because it's got blue tansy flower in it and blue chamomile. And it has a, and the oil, if you saw the oil, the, if you drop the oil on your skin, it's blue. That's natural blue dyes. It's not a, an actual dye that causes hormone disruptions. But I love this. Um, it it gives that heated sensation, mm -hmm. and especially for big areas. And it just once that ting it starts to tingle, and once the heat is gone and the tingling's gone, once the tingling's gone and that heat's there, it's like the pain has gone. Mm -hmm. So this is I use this this morning. I love this. Um, Okay, so this was deep blue, okay? So this stuff is amazing. Okay, so now we'll talk about the On Guard. So internally, um, you can use, so we talked about um, aromatically, topically, and I'll talk about internally. Okay, List here, make sure you hear me. I would never, ever, ever, ever 
use anybody else's essential oil internally, okay? And there's only certain ways you can use oils internally. Not all can be used, but some are safe. So, but but limited. You cannot drink a whole bottle of oil, okay? You have to you have to know guidelines, which is why we educate. But uh, a drop of oil in your water, um, or a drop or two oils in your water, is, does not hurt you. It actually helps. What it heals is your throat, all the way down your your esophagus, your intestines, all the way through the urogenital. So from taking in to taking out, it will actually nourish all of that, okay? And your liver and all the process that it's gonna go through in your body, as well as it gets in your bloodstream because it, I mean, once you swallow, it's, it's getting in your bloodstream, okay? So it can actually help with things like that. So UTIs, I mean, there's just lots of different things that you can use to help help by taking it internally. Now my favorite way is to use one drop of wild orange and a drop of peppermint in my water and it I, I'm not a coffee drinker okay so Julie is a coffee drinker but we're gonna work on her addiction with, with <laughs> coffee okay but I can't hit my body can't handle caffeine mm -hmm. it just it it does bad things to my body I, I do. What'd you say, John? John, my, John's here, y'all. My taste buds can't handle it. Okay, his taste buds can't handle it. I like the way it tastes. Yeah, and I it love smells. the way it smells. Yeah, but it's it's it. Let's just put it this way. I I would eat something non-organic mm -hmm. before I would drink coffee because well, it messes my body. If you up so look bad. at my coffee, see mm -hmm. the color? Yeah, it's mostly almond milk. Yeah, so <laughs> that's my excuse. Milk. There's yeah. no sugar. Oh, that's so. good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, okay, so so I like the one drop of peppermint and one drop of um, uh, wild orange in my water, and it gives me focused energy because the peppermint is energizing, and wild orange, all citrus oils, kind of give help me be focused mm -hmm. and alert. So I'm able to do a lot when I when I drink that in my water. Speaking of water, now you. If you put this in your water, it has to go in a glass. You cannot put it in plastic, styrofoam, um, even BPA free. It will pull out, it will detox that plastic and you're gonna be drinking petroleum. <laughs> so it doesn't, it's not acidic, so it's not eating through that way, it's pulling mm -hmm. out. So you can actually put a drop, um, you can put a drop on your uh, on styrofoam and watch what happens. Mm -hmm. So. My um, nephew has it. UTIs. Yeah, well, we can. Mm -hmm. Julie, Julie's got some information on that. We can definitely help you. You can even diffuse to help with that. We've been able to do that with um, my father-in-law. We actually noticed that he was not getting any, having any UTIs, and he used to have them all the time. And then I realized what I was diffusing for him every day, for another reason, actually helped UTIs. So I think that that's what was what mm -hmm. was helping him keep from getting them. So. Okay, so um, also as far as um, putting it in water, you can drop it under the tongue um, for sublingual, like if you're taking a sublingual B12 or something mm -hmm. like that, drop it under the tongue. Or um, you can put it in a, a capsule. So if you have gut issues, you are not going to want to drink oils because what's gonna happen is when you have gut issues, you have throat issues and you have mouth issues. You don't realize it and it's gonna to start to itch your mouth because it's gonna start detoxing your mouth. So it's not that it's you're having a reaction to it, it's that it is actually detoxing <laughs> all the stuff that's going on. So um, what you have to do in that case is you can get a veggie capsule. Let me show you. See? You can fill it up. I'm actually gonna, I'll show you guys how to do this. I'm gonna, well, it's on guard. no, I think I'll do, um, I'm not gonna use it, but I'm just gonna, cause it, I'm gonna show you. So you just put, let's see if I can do something making a mess. Cause I'm leaning forward and I can't see. <gasps> Got it in there. Okay, so you would put that in there and you would just put the lid on and then you just would take it, okay? Now, you can do things like pain bomb where you're gonna put other oils in there. So you, could, so you can put more oils in it. 
but if you just want to do for certain things, just however many, like there's like recipes, I guess you would say, mm -hmm. or protocols, and you would just do that and put it in there. You cannot do this be beforehand. You need to do this when you're ready to take it. Because this is gonna, yeah, cause this is gonna go right through mm -hmm. this. It's gonna pull through. Even though it's a veggie cap, um, and even though there's not like impurities in it, it's still gonna go right through it. So I'm gonna put this right here because it's gonna be going through in a few minutes. <laughs> um, okay, so this one I wanna talk about is On Guard. On Guard, I didn't use On Guard at first when I um, got oils because I didn't understand what it was for. <laughs> I didn't realize that I need to be putting this on my kids every day to mm -hmm. keep them well. Yeah. There's a learning curve, which is why another reason why I feel really strongly about educating mm -hmm. and teaching classes. Because if you're using oils. We should oils, let John testify in a minute about it. Yeah, so sure. Yeah. On yeah. So there's On Guard. It is a protective blend. I love it. To me, it smells like Christmas in a bottle. Mm -hmm. It's got clove and cinnamon. Yes. I don't know if it's awesome. <laughs> clove and cinnamon. And it will, it's a preventative. Mm -hmm. meaning that with the word protective but it also helps if you're having issues so it can keep you well and it can get you well so um john do you want to say anything about can we let you we turn it around? hold on i'm gonna i'm gonna turn it on you oh wait a minute no i'm not just okay. pull it down i think it'll shut it off there sorry okay. you guys here we go okay flash is on um yeah on guard yeah, I can testify it's really good because we were on a road trip at the time and we were in Blue Ridge, or I think it was Blue Ridge, Knoxville somewhere, but uh, I started having a sore throat coming on and I wasn't feeling very well, so uh, my mom got on guard from in the mail, um, so that she could put it in, you know, let me gargle it, gargle it. And actually, it helped a lot. Mm -hmm. it, it would take almost all of the pain away during the day. And it would only start hurting after I hadn't taken it in a while. In a while. Yeah. So yeah, it helps a lot. Yeah. Thank you, John. Um, and he, what he said there about he would use it, and then if, but if he hadn't used it in a while, in a while it would, the pain would start mm -hmm. to come back. That, I'm glad that he said that because the biggest thing with essential oils, which I really think with life in general, is mm -hmm. consistency. Oh, yeah. um, if, you, if you're sick, um, like John, if he was having a sore throat, then um, he would want to probably gargle every two to three hours. Mm -hmm. So don't wait for your symptoms to come back. Yeah. So do it every two to three hours. When you we use things, when your body uses things holistically, when, it's, when you introduce something holistic or natural to it, your body um, it takes it a while to realize that it can depend on it, mm -hmm. but um, what's not used in that three to four hours, it's excreted, so you have to keep, you know, keep doing it consistently, reapplying or reusing it, whatever yeah. method you were using it, um, until you are well. Um, if you have um, major issues, there's a, other ways that you can handle it, but any of these minor ailments like upset stomachs or poison ivy or um, sore throats, things like that. You're just going to want to use it every two to three hours. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so the On Guard, I told a little bit about that. It um, supports the body's natural antioxidant defenses. It has clove oil in it. If you're familiar with the Aura value um, chart for antioxidants, I'm like, and you may have heard that blueberries are really good for the brain and things mm -hmm. like that. Okay, blueberries in the thousands, clove is in the millions on the auric value. That means it's extremely high in antioxidants. Antioxidants, if you're not familiar, fight free radicals in your body. Free radicals are the bad things in your body that cause bad things. So, um, without saying exactly what that is, it's also known as miswritten DNA. So, if you've got some bad, bad stuff going on in your body, body antioxidants helps to get it better mm -hmm. so um which is why clove is amazing okay so now i want to talk about let me see oh i know what i want to say um go drop my paper if you are getting ready to send kids back to school um drop a number three on there <clears throat> and if you're interested in knowing how to keep your kids healthy mm -hmm. this school year um drop a four in there okay <laughs> and we'll get back with you on this Did you yeah and Sharon um, we're gonna answer your questions we're gonna answer them at the end if we can and if not we'll private message you yeah so we'll hit we'll hit reply we'll go mm -hmm. through when if this is over 
and we hit stop, we'll sit here and we'll look mm -hmm. through. And if it's something that's a quick response, like I can say, oh, we'll diffuse this or yeah. apply this topically, we'll do that quickly. But if it's going to take a little bit more in depth, we'll just, we'll say sending you a message. Mm -hmm. And Julie and I will work together on getting that answer. She's learning and, and so, but she's like, she does a lot though. So she needed to use oregano. When we first met, she was already using oregano. Oh yeah. So mm -hmm. oregano is awesome. Yes. 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 Oregano is the highest natural antibiotic for your family. It's one of the highest, especially in the oil family. Mm -hmm. Maluca would be like number two. Yeah. Okay, so refer to my notes. Okay, <clears throat> so I want to talk, um, let's see, first of all, a little bit about why doTERRA essential oils, because you may be like, well, I can get essential oils at Big Lots or the grocery store or Walmart or Target, and actually you can, except for they're not real essential oils. Um, let me see how I can say this. It's kind of like, so doTERRA has been an oil company for eight years. Essential oils have been since the Bible. It's mentioned over 500 times in the Bible. So um, essential oils have actually been around. They've just not been mainstream. Well, doTERRA is one of the companies that has helped to bring it mainstream. So when things are brought mainstream, just like the fidget spinner, everyone gets on the bandwagon, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so, and it becomes a fad. You know, yeah. sorry, sorry, but they are, they're fads. Yeah, they are. Just like those bracelets and those pet rocks and things yes, like that. slap on bracelets. Yeah, yeah. So it's, it's a, it's a fad to the, to the industry of Walmart and Target because, mm -hmm. you know, obviously whatever they can get on to make money on, they're going to, but that's not what doTERRA is. doTERRA is an education science company. Okay. We are not bad we have science reports we we deal with um, John Hopkins University and Duke University and we are we're in a two-year study with them actually with how essential oils work hospitals are using them and we are here to help you with with knowledge about this okay all right so why again why doTERRA essential oils well one thing that doTERRA does is co-impact sourcing um, the growers are organized in a cooperative with teachings, trainings, capacity building, and coordinated services. So we go in and we help the farmers, okay? We, we um, help them get a fair wage. We even pay them in advance in most cases because about 70% of our oils come from third world countries. It's not when you think, okay, made in China. <laughs> the reason why we get oils in from other countries is because we get the oil from the original growing source. When you harvest a plant in soil that has been harvested in many years, I mean, you're rotating your crops, obviously, but that soil, it makes it therapeutic. Mm -hmm. So if you're gonna get the strongest therapeutic value out of that oil when it is sourced from the original growing spot. Okay, yes, I could grow some vetiver here or, grow, or, or try to grow a Boswellia tree off of a cliff here. Um, which is frankincense, but um, it's probably not going to do very well, yeah. right? Have you ever tried to plant a garden and it just flop, right? Yeah, because that's of like the trying to grow, soil? I don't know, pineapples or some kind of tropical thing. Right, here. you got to grow it work. where it's supposed to grow. Hey, Dale, mm -hmm. you got to grow it where it's a, where it was where it was mm -hmm. meant to grow. Okay, mm -hmm. so that is why it's harvested all over the world. Okay, we that ever comes from Haiti. We have. Um, uh, cardamom comes from Guatemala and um, frankincense comes from Oman and Somalia and um, so there's just a uh, lavender from Bulgaria and um, so just in south of France so just different areas okay well a lot of these countries they do not have the money the farmers I mean it, it takes money to make money right mm -hmm. okay so they had to they had to do things to these crops right they had to pay their workers and they can't do that ahead of time so doTERRA pays them ahead of time mm -hmm. You know, I don't know, I can't, no, don't know the details if it's 50% or whatever, but they help them get started and so that they can help their kids and their family. And so it's, it's really amazing. We also go in and um, we help to um, sustain the, the area there. We give them a better quality of life. Um, doTERRA is, um, it's a company that they like to use the word servant leader, which really spoke to me because we use that term in our mm -hmm. own household. But they go in and they, they make relationships with these people. They have built schools and schools for girls, which over in countries, in a lot of countries, they don't have schools for girls. 
they're not expected to, to learn to read or write or anything like that. Um, so they built schools for girls. They helped with human trafficking, given a lot of money towards that. Um, they have built hospitals and paid the doctor's annual salary. They have built a pipeline when there wasn't any water. And when they were walking two hours a day to get water, they built a pipeline. So all that, I just, that made me fall in love with the company because missions is a huge part of my heart. And one of the reasons why I wanted to um, earn extra income mm -hmm. so that I could pay off debt because we want to serve as a family, not necessarily full time, um, but somehow in some capacity and we want to support missionaries. Yeah, that's like, exactly like why we're here. Well, <laughs> yeah. first of all, the oils, I love the right. oils um, and how effective they are. But, um, but yeah, that's why we're, that's why I'm yeah. doing this. Right, mm -hmm. right. I mean, it's a, you know, it's a... One of the reasons. Right. I like sharing the oils too, so. <laughs> uh, yeah. I know we can't how can you not share if you know some that mm -hmm. you can help somebody yeah how can you not share okay so the pair is just a beautiful company I feel like and the founders are beautiful and just awesome and so we're gonna talk about frankincense now frankincense supports healthy cellular function it is um, you can add two to three drops to a veggie capsule like I showed you um, well actually I'm sorry I just read off the wrong thing <laughs> that was for on card <laughs> See, it's very easy to teach a class. All you have to do is read. Just make sure you're reading the right section, right? Okay, right. you can take frankincense that way, but that's not the sentence I was trying to say. And um, you can use it topically to beautify the skin. I'm sure Cleopatra probably used lots of frankincense. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. <laughs> it supports the body's natural antioxidant defense. We talked about antioxidants before. It also corrects miswritten DNA. And if you don't know what that is, you can ask me in a private message what is miswritten DNA. But what it actually does is it goes in, it identifies the miswritten DNA. If it cannot correct it, then it destroys it. Okay? So it doesn't destroy healthy cells, just the miswritten ones. Um, frankincense has a, I don't know, I can't explain the smell, but um, to me it smells like what you think frankincense will smell well, like. If you, well, if you've been in church and you do anointing oil, yeah. it smells, yeah. it smells kind of like that. Yeah, we use it. We use frankincense for anointing oil at church. Yeah. Um, my husband's a associate pastor at our church and um, we, we use frankincense for that reason. Um, uh, let's see, what else did I want to say about frankincense? Oh, I want to tell you that when frankincense is used with myrrh, you give it to a newborn baby, it helps the the baby to have the um, support that its body needs for um, immunity, so the immune support. Um, also, um, when you give it to a mom that's just given birth, it helps to regulate her hormones. Mm -hmm. So it makes you think about why Mary Jesus. and Joseph were given, yeah. why baby Jesus mm -hmm. had um, frankincense and myrrh. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so also another thing I want to say about the bottles, two things, is um, Let's see, when using diffusers, it's best to have mist on or off. Mist on. Mist, yeah, that's how yeah. it works. Yeah. yeah, have the mist on. Yeah. So, do you see right there, it's going to be backwards, but it says supplement facts. Okay, if this says supplement, then a supplement is something you can take internally. Only doTERRA. Only do. yes, yeah. please stress that. But I'm going to tell you, you can get a bottle of lavender at Walmart. Lavender. You can eat a lavender flower, okay? I mean, you can have mm -hmm. lavender internally. You can have lemons internally. Who eats lemons, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's lemon pie, right? Um, but if the oils that you know that you can already, that you could eat, like consume, lemon or yeah. consume, if it says do not take internally or put on skin, then that should be a red flag yeah. that, um, okay. Not for human consumption. Yeah, that something else is in that bottle. Mm -hmm. Which brings me to say this, um, the FDA only requires oil companies to put 80% of what's actually in the bottle. Which, did you know that food, like a box of food, mm -hmm. you know, they only had to put 75% of the ingredients, wow. okay? This is why you, you don't eat processed things, because yeah. if they're willing to, the things that they're not willing to tell you makes me wonder mm -hmm. what is actually, oh, yeah. what's actually in it, so. So with that, doTERRA wanted to be a transparent company, a company that you could trust. And so they came up with a, um, a seal, it's called Certified Pure Therapeutic Grade. 
and it's right there and it's a CPTG okay so that is our that's our standard okay that means that if you see that on there that this batch of oil has gone through third-party testing with five to seven different tests once it comes back to the Terra the Terra does the same testing they compare the results and as long as everything matches they keep it if not they throw it out um, so you know how expensive it is to make the oils but if but that's their standard they're not gonna sell something that is not yeah. that's not pure okay a good website to write down is source to you.com you have a lot number on the bottom of your bottle and you can type in that lot number I did it it was fun I did it once it was fun it told me what my bottle was oh you have lemon or you have frankincense and it gave me the report I'm gonna be honest with you I have no idea what that report meant but the fact that this company is willing to show the report mm -hmm. on the bottom mm -hmm. then that that's all I need to know yeah. you know I'm very thankful that that it is a transparent company there's a lot of companies out there that are not and so I'm thankful for that um the last product actually I think I want to talk about two more things before I go into the last product I want to talk about um oils that I kind of don't talk about much at um my uh my intro classes is oils called serenity and balance I know it's backwards, but Serenity and Bounce. Serenity is the restful blend, okay? It has a vetiver in it. It has, um, let's see what else in it. Lavender, cedarwood, hoewood, ylang ylang, marjoram, rum and chamomile, and vetiver. Okay, this is really good if you're having a hard time getting rest at night, okay? So it would be good for to put on the bottom of a baby's foot? Um, baby, or just, I like just, just the lavender for okay. babies. Mm -hmm. And lavender is, is um, a pretty um, mild oil, but yeah, mm -hmm. I would just want lavender probably yeah. for babies. Okay. Um, so this is the restful blend. Okay, it helps great for that. This is our balance blend. This is grounding, and the feeling of grounding just kind of it's just it's a balance in our mm -hmm. hormones. Okay, when we're off balance, you can just feel you know I don't even know how to explain it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll be like, I'll be like, okay, my body's off balance. And until I really realized what it was, I didn't understand the feeling. But when we pay attention to our body and we learn more, then we know, oh, okay, well, my, mm -hmm. my, body, my hormones are out of balance. Oh, yeah. I'm off balance. Okay, so this is fantastic to use um, every morning before you even get started for the day or to use for cranky teenagers. Um, John's not ever cranky, so he doesn't need any of this. Um, but if you're having, um, like, really really hard times resting or if you're having severe anxious feelings you can combine these together and um, and it's like liquid sleep in a bottle or liquid calm in a bottle and you can use both of these together and it will stop those really really bad um, feelings that one person may be having that and I'm trying not to use anxiety <laughs> but Mm -hmm. You're having that feeling. It can it can help stop, and you, you will feel your body slow down. It's a weird feeling because you're like, you're you know your mind is wanting your mind's like okay I'm having this horrible feeling, but mm -hmm. but then all of a sudden you feel your body slow down, and you're like how's that working? Yeah. Usually I have to talk myself mm -hmm. into getting through yeah. something like this, right? Mind over matter, you can get through this, but this is how your body reacts chemically to the oils, which is amazing because God made it that way. That's why there was no stress in the Garden of Eden. <laughs> well, sin was not there yet, obviously, but can you imagine um, the aromatic smells and, you know, it's just like, there's more to these oils than, I can't wait to find out. I bet there's, I don't even know what heaven's going to be like, but I bet it's going to smell nice. Oh, yeah. But I bet there's going to be just beautiful gardens everywhere. But, okay, so our number one product is um, our lifelong vitality pack. Okay, so you're gonna, and I remember first hearing this. This is an oil company and vitamins are their number one product. <laughs> um, I was like, I don't know, I don't understand that. I do now, okay. Um, <clears throat> my husband and I have studied vitamins and supplements for about 25 years. He has MS and we really feel like that God gave him knowledge beforehand before learning, mm -hmm. you know, before yeah. he knew that he was going to need yeah. need this support because um, he's had it for at least 15 years.
He has bad days, don't get me wrong, mm -hmm. but um, he's still here. And that's a huge thing. We feel, mm -hmm. really feel like, yeah, praise God, that God gave him this knowledge ahead of time. So I, he tore apart the ingredients on, on the, the vitamins. He investigated them, researched them, and he, before he would even let me buy any. <laughs> and he's like, okay, we can take these. <laughs> so they're amazing because of what they do for the body. First of all, you get three bottles. This is your cellular support, okay? So this is gonna help with um, the, the process of your cells with antioxidants, and we were talking about free radicals. Okay, this has got all the great things in it that it's got polyphenols in it, it's got turmeric in it, it's got um, alkalopoic acid, and um, quercetine, all, and you may not know what all those things do. My husband could sit there and tell you exactly what each, and I may, I think I'm going to do that, let mm -hmm. him record. Oh, yeah. He could sit there and tell you what each individual thing did what the daily recommended allowances, but what you should be taking mm -hmm. and things like that. So this stuff, this is amazing. So that's for your sales. This is the omegas. So this is your uh, three, six, and nines, vitam other vitamins like A, D, and E. Um, most Americans are vitamin D sufficient. One thing we don't go outside in the sun because they've mm -hmm. done scared us that yeah. we're gonna get sun skin cancer from the sun. But we don't, we work inside. Yeah. You know, we, we do, we work inside, we go to school inside, we don't, the kids don't play anymore. So most Americans are vitamin D sufficient, insufficient. Um, okay, so that's your omegas. And then this is your um, food nutrient. This is whole food nutrients. Yes, you should be able to get your vitamins out of your food, but you can't because mm -hmm. our soil is depleted. Yeah. yeah. It's, um, and we don't. We don't eat whole foods no. and whole fruits. Like, and the vitamins are predominant in the fruit when you pick it, mm -hmm. not when it ships to the grocery oh, store yeah. and it sits there. So you're losing the enzymes when you cook the food. You're, when you cook food, all the enzymes are gone. So if you have vegetables and you cook them, the, best, the enzymes are gone, mm -hmm. which is supposed to help in your gut, right? So that's a whole nother, whole nother thing. Okay, so here, the vitamins. This is why this is our number one product. This this is why. It has essential oils in it. There, It has nine. It has frankincense in it, which you should put frankincense in your body every day because it's going to prevent you, a good preventative for miswritten DNA. Um, it has, um, okay, I've lost my... Where, oh, it's on my paper. Why don't I do that? Because my eyes are not letting me <laughs> read that. Okay, it has frankincense, thyme, cumin, orange, peppermint, ginger, caraway, um, German chamomile, and clove. You remember about clove? I told you it was really high on the right value <laughs> with antioxidants. Okay, so I, gonna be honest with you, I didn't take the vitamins at first. Mainly because I wanted my husband and my father-in-law to take the vitamins. They need them. Once I was able to supplement my income enough where I could afford for me to take them and my children to take them, I started taking them. One day I forgot to take mine, okay, because I was busy and it, it, it was yet not an importance to me, okay. Mm -hmm. I was, had not gotten the habit of taking it. Well, the next day I felt bad. I couldn't think, I couldn't function, my hormones were out of whack, and I didn't realize that um, my hormones had been coming in check. Mm -hmm. I didn't realize that because I'm actually postmenopause, even though I'm 40 years old, I'm postmenopause. So I've got a little crazy going on. <laughs> so I didn't realize that um, that it had been helping. Mm -hmm. And I'd actually been praying, um, Lord, please show me what I need to do for my, my hormones because mm -hmm. I've been having problems with that. And um, so a week later, I forget to take it and I realized Oh my gosh, these have been helping me, and Lord, Lord answered my prayer, and so now I make sure that I, I don't miss because it's not that it has something in it that's addicting that make me a trick to take mm -hmm. them. My body was lacking severely, yeah. and it was giving my body what it needed, and I felt good, yeah. and so it's like my body wants that again, right? Okay. So what I want to say about the vitamins is normally they're like well over a hundred dollars it's normal like if you were just to order them retail. but you can right well retail yeah, yeah. yeah. even wholesale they're over a hundred dollars mm -hmm. but if you um order order them we have a loyalty reward program and if you wanted them through that then you can get them half price 
So it's, it's, it's fantastic. I just wanted to plug that in because I may forget later on to say that when we were talking about vitamins. Um, so that we have other, there's other things to help with different issues and stuff, but this is a um, intro to oils. Mm -hmm. So if you've never heard of oils or didn't know how to use them, we wanted to be able to kind of bring that information to you. We teach men's classes, which I have one tomorrow night in Fayetteville. If anybody wants to come to Fayetteville, um, just message me and let me know. If, if I don't have anyone come, I may just do it live stream, I'm not for sure, but um, my husband and I are gonna be teaching that one together. So we have a men's class tomorrow night. We do women's classes, um, oils of the Bible, Julie's going to be doing a lot of those. Mm -hmm. um, in fact, she just got her. Where did you? She just got her her class paper in for that. Yes. <laughs> so, um, oils of the Bible. We have kids classes. Um, uh, just a lot of information. Um, so if we can get together, we can help you with um, a kind of. Um, if you have an issue that we kind of want to isolate and go over. So I do free consultations, do one-on-ones mm -hmm. and things like that. So whatever your needs are for that, um, just just message or say, I want to know a class about this mm -hmm. or something like that and we'll get in touch with you. But last thing I want to say is that, okay, so you may be wondering, okay, well, how can I get essential oils? You told me all these wonderful things that it's going to do to help my family and to stay healthy or but even to um, lower your toxic load as far as like cleaning, you clean with it and everything. So if you're going to replace, mm -hmm. make your own deodorant or, I know that sounds weird, but it is, it does work. Uh, mm -hmm. or, or stuff to clean with or shampoos or anything like that. Um, so you can use oils for that. So if you're wondering, okay, these are awesome, I want to get some oils. Um, well, first of all, I want to say that Julie and I, we do not sell oils, okay? This, we share oils, we share knowledge our main job is to is to educate okay mm -hmm. so um, we educate with how to use them we teach classes and then if you want to get oils then you can get a wholesale account mm -hmm. and that's what we we don't we have a saying that friends don't let friends buy retail we don't like this you can buy it retail but we we would much rather you save 25% mm -hmm. <laughs> so you can it's like a a, so, a Sam's Club membership, right? Okay, so you get a Sam's Club and you can buy what you want all year and I don't know what the percentage is. Our, we're 25% off. So you just pay $35 and you can get it all year. You can order once or never again anything, any of the products. And you can have it come to your door. Yes, it yeah. ships directly mm -hmm. to you, three ninety nine dollars shipping. Mm -hmm. And you get, well, it's Yeah, you ways. can you can actually get certain your shipping ways. back. Yeah, yeah. that mm -hmm. we have a loyalty reward program. Mm -hmm. Like I told you, you could get the um, the vitamins discounted. Um, you can get the shipping back mm -hmm. in points to buy more stuff with. Um, so um, it's real easy to be able to do that. And it's, um, it's pretty neat because um, it's it's just like it's your own your own wholesale account mm -hmm. so you can order anytime you want order whatever you want as much or as little yeah and it's not like you're like oh, okay well let me call my oil lady I need to get oils or something like that or or like everyone likes shopping online anyway right mm -hmm. Amazon Prime right <laughs> you can get things mm -hmm. in two days well you can get this in three to five days ship to your door whatever you want and it's there's no minimum or maximum order just order what order what you want when you want mm -hmm. it's really the smartest smartest thing to do and um, also we do have a loyalty reward program like I was telling you about and um, where every time you order you can get points you can earn for a percentage back like frequent flyer miles mm -hmm. so we have a Sam's Club membership and we have frequent flyer miles <laughs> those are the equivalents of it so um, that's how I get like my frankincense I get it free I don't pay for it um, I ship my daughter hundred dollars worth of oils at a time um, so it's it's really easy to um, to do that so if you want to know more about that you can let us know um, so if you want to get oils you want to get a wholesale membership then um, you can message us or just put something at the bottom mm -hmm. and Julie and I will spend um, the rest of the day trying to get all these answered if they are let me show the book okay. if you some questions I'm gonna have to research and um, I have a couple books that we research and um, how oils help so that might take us a couple of days to get back with you on that but we will let you know hey we're going over this because it is important to us your questions are very important to us because we want to help people right okay so this is like a ministry well to both of us oh yeah they have their their, their life 
they live their life as a ministry. And my husband is in ministry at church, and we've always been in ministry. But we have Health and Family Ministries is the name of our ministry. And part of that is sharing about oils because um, my family went, has gone through a lot health-wise. We have a long story with children that are not well, and we've gone through a lot. And this has helped us, and if we could help somebody else, we spend a lot of money and cause a lot of heartache mm -hmm. and that on things that oils could have helped. Oh, yeah. And so we have a lot of regret in that area. So how do you turn around regret, right? You learn from the experience and you help other people, oh, yeah. right? So that's why that's why we do this. So um, uh, if you are interested in holding a class, okay, so this mm -hmm. is... I'm kind of launching Julie out mm -hmm. and like Julie's gonna be doing these she's gonna be doing live videos mm -hmm. she's gonna be doing continuing oil education where she may just specifically talk about one oil and tell you everything that it helps do um, because you wouldn't believe the things that the oils help help do um, my husband didn't believe me at first even though he was in natural stuff he didn't believe me at first but um but she's gonna be doing that so we want to support Julie okay everything anything that you do if you everything helps support Julie okay and in um, our ministry and their ministry right because they're sub they're trying to supplement mm -hmm. their, their income right mm -hmm. okay um, because um, unfortunately minute ministry's hard we've been in ministry 20 something years and it's it's not for the faint it's of heart. It's not a rich business. No, it's not. It's not a money maker. It's yeah. not. You're not in it for that. If you were, if you are, you're going to out of it. Yeah. It's not what it's for. But God does provide. Yes, he does. And he uses different mm -hmm. ways to provide. And mm -hmm. and um, so one way that you can help Julie is by hosting a class. For, you'll get a free oil or maybe a book or something for hosting a class. That would help her. You can even host an online class. Maybe you, all of your family lives across the U.S., out of state. You can host a class that way. Um, so get with Julie, get with me, and we can. We can. I'm still helping her, and we can um, do that. Um, so uh, one of the last thing that I want to say is that all the people that have commented below. Mm -hmm. So if you've not commented, this is your last chance to comment. So the last thing I want you to comment is what oil that you heard would you think that you would want to use, like that you could benefit from? All the oils that we talked about, we talked about peppermint, we talked about breathe, deep blue, on guard, melaleuca, frankincense, serenity balance, and the vitamins. Out of those, which oil do you feel like you could benefit from the most? Okay, so if you haven't commented, this is your chance now. Mm -hmm. You're gonna wanna comment, yes. because tell them why. Because <laughs> you're gonna get um, an entry into a drawing. Um, and I think it's going to be... Well, we'll, we'll choose one of these. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Free oil. Yeah, we're going to give a free so, oil. Yes. That's right. So that's why if you've not commented, you need to comment now. Mm -hmm. So thank you yes, for thank your time. You. Your time's important to it us. Is. Absolutely. Yeah. It's a busy world. Mm -hmm. We know. Mm -hmm. It is. Yeah. So, so. you want to shut so it off? We, we thank appreciate you, you coming <laughs> and joining our class. And we love everyone. Yeah. <laughs>